गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन नाउ द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक दैट इज आउटपुट डिवाइसेज इन केस ऑफ कंप्यूटर बिकॉज इन द प्रीवियस सेशन वी हैव कवर्ड नंबर ऑफ इनपुट डिवाइसेज नाउ द टर्न इज ऑफ डिफरेंट नंबर ऑफ आउटपुट डिवाइसेज सो एज विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस पिक्चर यू कैन शेयर दैट वन ऑफ द मोस्ट कॉमन आउटपुट डिवाइस इन टर्म्स ऑफ कंप्यूटर इज मॉनिटर सो बिकॉज ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन विच वी टेक विद द हेल्प ऑफ सम इनपुट डिवाइसेज then after processing that particular data which we take with the help of input devices once get processed then it uh, then it it is displayed with the help of this monitor okay that means this monitor is used for the display purpose then after that we are having this speaker also so speaker like uh, with the help of microphone if i am saying something then how i can get the output of that uh, sound with the help of a speaker i can listen so a speaker is one kind of output device and after that uh, headphones obviously they are also one kind of output device because with the help of these headphones we are listening the sound or the music or the audio files okay so that is why these all are some output devices and some more output devices we are having just like printers also there so one by one we will discuss these all kind of output devices so let us start first of all uh, the first type of input uh, sorry output device that is monitor so what do you mean by monitor as i have told you that uh, monitor is one kind of output device that is used to display the information because once the data is inputted with the help of different number of input devices then after the processing we have to display that particular information to the user so for display that particular information we just use one visual display unit that means this monitor is also known as visual display unit so if one question comes in exam that what do you mean by visual display unit then don't get confused because in the visual display unit means the monitor okay so you can write down uh, for, uh, you can write down about monitors if one question come uh, for explaining the visual display unit so monitors commonly called as visual display unit and these are the main output device as you very well know that monitor is one of the most important and most common output device without which without this I, we cannot do anything on computer is if i will process uh, if the computer will process the data but if it is it will not be displayed on the screen then obviously there will be no use of that particular information so obviously monitors are very much important in the field of computer uh so this monitor forms the images from tiny dots why the, what what are these tiny dots these tiny dots are basically the number of pixels because all the images um, all the images all the characters all the numbers which uh, which are getting displayed onto the monitor is basically uh, is been uh, with the help of this pixel uh, obviously so these pixels are arranged in a rectangular form and uh, these with the help of these pixel means uh, the combination of these pixels form any kind of number image or uh, any text so the sharpness of uh, the image like if the image is very sharp if the image is very blur then obviously it depends upon the number of pixels if you zoom out any of the image then obviously it don't get blurred why because you are uh, you are increasing the number of pixels that is why okay so that is uh, if uh, uh, if you are having the smaller pixels then obviously the image will be very clear and if you will increase the size of the pixels then obviously the quality of that image will be decreased so this is one kind of monitor then after that uh, uh, if we talk about it how many types of uh, and how many kinds of monitors are there so obviously for uh, uh, in computers we are having more than uh, two monitors and the first one is cathode ray tube and the second one is lcd and the third one is flat panel display so each and every uh, monitor is totally different from each other so first of all i'll t- uh, tell you about uh, the uh, crt monitor and this is one of kind of uh, crt monitor 
and uh, this CRT stands for cathode ray tube as uh, this cathode ray tube can be uh, you can display uh, you can check like behind this spring so this cathode ray tube is basically um, attached with this uh, flat display so it is made up of uh, some uh, small picture elements and uh, these are also called pixels because monitor the structure of monitor works upon these pixels without which we cannot do, uh, do anything without which we cannot display anything so all the monitors works upon this technology so the smaller the pixels obviously the better the image clarity or the resolution obviously i have told you so it takes more than one uh, illuminated pixel to form a whole character means uh, not only one pixel is used to write this uh, the single character for writing the single character obviously we will collect we will uh, combine number of pixels then only this single letter will be formed that means if, if i want to write this complete paragraph then obviously for that purpose uh, i'll name it number of or the combination of uh, multiple pixels okay so this is basically how the com how the monitors work in terms of computer then uh, uh, in case of uh, crt monitor if we talk about the disadvantage of crt because after the uh, after this uh, monitor we are having some new technologies like in nowadays we are using flat panel display monitors then obviously there were some disadvantages of this monitor that is why some new technologies came that is why for making this uh, monitor more better so uh, the disadvantages part in the case of this crt monitor was that it was large in size obviously these are uh, these uh, monitors was large in size and obviously they take um, and they consume more power or a very high power they consume and uh, because of the big size they take more more um, lay space uh, to to keep it anywhere so this was all about the crt monitor then uh, after that we are having the next type of monitor that is lcd monitor so this lcd stands for basically the liquid crystal display monitors uh, why we are saying that liquid crystal display because in case of lcd monitor basically we use um, the in case of this we are having one light we are having a uh, light or uh, we can say that it provides uh, these the kind of monitors provides light to individual pixels uh, to arrange in a rectangular grid means each pixel has uh, some uh, sub pixels like r g b means red green and blue pixels so they are having and these uh, sub pixels can be turned on and can be turned off so like you have seen different number of flag boards flag boards i think you have seen like if you are going to the doctor then uh, on the top of the uh, board it is written that this is one uh, uh, hospital the name of the, of the hospital is written over the flag board so and uh, so basically this is what this is the kind of this technology lcd technology and uh, different number of boards in the offices uh, we use these lcd screens these lcd uh, displays so that is basically known as a indoor and outdoor signage so so when all the sub pixels are turned on then uh, then it appears white and if uh, the sub pixels are turned off then it appears like black so by adjusting the individual levels of red green and blue light millions of colors combinations are possible so this is uh, all about lcd monitors i'll uh, clear uh, uh, like i'll tell you uh, about this lcd monitor so more definitions i'll tell you so this is one kind of lcd monitor and uh, like this is one this is one kind of uh, uh, indoor uh, sorry outdoor signage which we use in in, in case of the signage uh, basically this lcd technology is being used then uh, if uh, uh, some more uh, definitions i'll tell you then obviously lcds are used in a wide range of applications as you know very well because in nowadays lcds are being used in case of televisions uh, computer monitors in different number of instrument panels we are using this lcd and uh, i have told you that in indoor signage and in outdoor signage 
physically the sensitive technology is used because in case of the sensitivity we can uh, the light is also going so uh, just like lcd is uh, display, uh, replaced uh, the older display technology so they have started being replaced by new display technology such as led okay, so lcd and led these are the two terms and uh, lcds are basically uh, use less electric power than crd so that is why these are used uh, in most of the places and these are most commonly used in nowadays also so as it is a light and compact uh, and obviously thin in size as you can compare the lcd and the uh, crd monitor so these uh, lcds are basically flat uh, flat displays now after that um, if, if i talk about this lcd obviously i have told you that it stands for liquid crystal display and this is a flat panel display technology which is most commonly used in tvs and computer monitors most commonly it is used in these technologies but we can use in other technologies also so it is also used in screens for mobile devices such as laptops tablets and smartphones also so in these uh, all type of devices uh, generally lcd monitors and lcd screens are used then after that the next type of output device or the next type of uh, monitor that is flat panel monitors so flat panel flat, uh, flat panel monitors have less volume less weight and less power consumption compared to cathode ray tube and compared to even lcds also okay so due to the advantage of this flat panel display the uses of crt decreased so as the flat panel devices are light in weight in comparison to even cr uh, sorry the uh, this uh, uh, what uh, the lcd so flat panel display allows the user to view the data graphics text and images like this this is a very means a very flat panel display is used in case of flat panel monitors or even flat panel televisions so these screens uh, means if uh, if we compare all this uh, flat panel display screen with the lcd the normal flat panel screens are a few folds there now in comparison to cr uh, in comparison to lcd and uh, uh, we just corrected that in comparison to lcd the, these flat panel screens are few folds there now okay we just correct it this is basically lcd because if i compare this flat panel screen with crd then obviously there are uh, much more difference there are a very big difference between these two but if i compare this flat panel screen with uh, lcd then some few fold th thinner uh, is this uh, flat panel screen so it often consumes less energy so like that we went hope you have understood these all kinds of monitor so thank you and so much